switching gears here now at 637, and I do mean this literally. Our Drew Miller has a story for all you motorsport fans. Drew, what are you up to? Yes, good morning, Monica. I'm in the Cap KVU news car getting ready for my next race, and recently I met a group of car enthusiasts who have created a bond through competition. Now they meet regularly at the Old Tri-Cities Raceway and have invited me into their world of controlled chaos. Take a look. We're, we're all car people, so we're, we're folks that enjoy our cars and, you know, we spend time talking about cars, and then when we uh, get bored, we'll all get together and talk about cars. Not a boring day today for the Sand and Sage Sports Car Club. It's like having a second family. We all help each other, even people who are in tight competition with each other will help each other if their car breaks or they need something. Um, that's just the kind of people we are. It's time trial racing, so each car gets the track all to themselves. That way they can attempt to beat their previous time. These speedsters are taking tight turns on a slippery track and making it look easy. And they say anyone and any car can compete. All right, I'm up next. Matt's here, my co-pilot. We're going to have ourselves a good time. Okay, so I'll admit I wasn't the fastest, but I do feel like a winner with all my new friends. Now the Sand and Sage Sports Car Club is very active on Facebook, so if you'd like to get in on the fun, ask to join, and that's it. Reporting live, Drew Miller, Cap View Local News. Thank you, Drew. How much fun is that? Fun. The car's still good. <laughs> Obviously, sitting in it right now. He didn't knock any cones over. Yeah, who knew the Cap KVU car was such a race right? car? Right? So right. fun. Well, the